So have you been listening to Alfredo's new album? I have, it's fantastic, very good. He'd be, he'd be number one in Australia, number one. Welcome to the Queen Street Gym for Alfredo's event tonight. Are you guys all very excited to see Alfredo? Um, how did you find out about the gig? He's actually singing at my daughter's wedding in January. Oh, wow. So you've known of him for a very long time? while yeah so and Melina's known him hi how are you um, hi. heard him years ago so hi. yeah we're friends of his yeah and so have you got his cd and been listening to it at home oh, yes yes it's in the, yes, car. It's in the he's car amazing yeah he's amazing yeah, yeah. Hey guys Hi, Sue and Ivors. How are you this evening? We are fantastic. We are fantastic. We are, we are so moon. happy to be here. It's so exciting. Can't wait. Can't, can't wait. wait. Can't wait. So how long have you guys known Alfredo for? It hasn't been long, but it feels like it's been forever. Yeah. It just, it's just one of those connections. It's part of the fabric now, so Absolutely. we're really looking forward to the performance. And I just managed to mop his brow because he looked warm, so I feel very special. It was a very special moment. Oh, it's great to be here, really, to see my good friend Alfredo. And so, have you guys been excited about tonight for a while? Yeah, very excited. I mean, we've been so excited. We've been talking about this, what, for the last three weeks? Absolutely. It's been wonderful. Really looking forward to seeing the show tonight. I came back from the UK early just to see him. I know you did. You've been worldwide just for this event tonight. And so, have you been listening to his CD? Oh yeah, I have a specially signed CD of his, so I'm a big fan. Big fan? Big fan. It's in my car. I play it all the time. I love Alfredo. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Hi Jennifer, how are you this evening? Very well, thank you my love. So are you excited about Alfredo doing his um, gig tonight? Um, I always love to hear Alfredo. It's just so, I love his voice. I've known Alfredo for 18 years. So I'm always here to support him. How did you first meet Alfredo? I saw him uh, upstairs at the Leaderville Hotel. I just arrived in Perth and I couldn't believe it. This guy was so talented. I loved his voice and we got on like a house on fire. So he's got a very, he's got a very captivating voice, hasn't he? Absolutely. And he also loves my own songs. And Roy Martinez, his bass player, played on all my songs too. So I've got a connection there. So, so you've been uh, working with Alfredo for a while? I've known Alfredo now for quite a few years. I work with him for the promotional work here, a couple of photos here. But amazing man, love the guy. He's like family to me, absolutely love the guy. And how did you first meet him? I first met him in Sydney at one of his events. So that was a long time ago. So I think I was a teenager and Alfredo was 50. Wow. <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> he, would have, he would have been a teenager as well, I'm sure. Yes, I think, I think I met Alfredo the first time when he just arrived back from Los Angeles, LA, when he was playing in the real seedy town of downtown LA, working for tips in a jar, and then he arrived in Australia. We've certainly come a long way since then. So, so what's your thoughts on this evening's gig? Oh, it's lovely. Uh, you know what, it's, it's cool. Like at first I was thinking it's a bit like, what do you mean you're playing in a boxing ring? But uh, now that I see the affair and the people here, it's, it's looking great. It's yeah. quite a cool concept, actually, to watch the boxing ring, the way it's all been set up at the Queen Street gym here. It's, it's almost vintage in a way. Like, I always imagine, like, old gigs and, like, crooners and all of that playing in boxing rings and that kind of, you know, crowd. They like entertainment. And uh, uh, boxing rings, like, you know, the center point of entertainment back in the day. So, yeah. Oh, wow. So, it's your first time actually seeing Alfredo perform live? Yes. Yeah. And have you got any pre-expectations? No, I have absolutely no idea what to expect. I'm going to be pleasantly surprised, I think. Awesome. We always like new fans, so well done. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. So, um, are you excited to see him perform? Absolutely. I can't wait. I've actually been in here, um, <laughs> I've actually been watching the rehearsals and everything, so I think it's going to be a really awesome night. And um, yeah, really looking forward to seeing the band come together and yeah, it should be really good. Do you actually have his CD at home? We do, actually. We all do. Yeah. <laughs> we all do. Is there any other comments that you would like to make about his music? Uh, no, not really. <laughs> He's putting you on the spot, aren't I? He, he can literally do anything. He's very good. Whatever. He's a very, very talented man, very Alfredo versatile. is. Oh, very versatile, yes. Very good. <laughs> Thank you. Hello there, my ladies. How are you this evening? I'm, I'm interviewing you guys and your thoughts on Alfredo's music. Um, have you got his city at home? Yeah, I do. It's really smooth. I really enjoy his music. And 
Um, have you seen him perform live before? No, well, not if you don't count a few things where he's done, you know, off the record. But just like this, not with an orchestra. Hello, ladies. How are you tonight? Hello. Hello. How long have you known Alfredo for? Well, Miriam's known Alfredo a very long time, and I've known Alfredo just after Miriam. Well, a couple of years after Miriam, but um, I've written one of the songs for him tonight that he's performing, so called Miss Congeniality, so I'm really excited about that. And um, how long have you known him? 30 years. Um, he's he's a, a consummate performer, and I remember seeing him perform at uh, Fl the Floriet, and I've met that there's no one in Australia that ac actually can do what he can do. Yeah, he's if you brilliant. see him live solo as a as a, as a accomplished pianist and an artist and a singer, I don't believe there's anybody in Australia that can perform. No, he's very talented. To his. So you obviously followed him throughout his whole career. So what do you, you find with his new CD? What do you think of his new CD? Oh, it's gorgeous. I mean, he's he's better than Chris Rea. He's got that Chris Rea kind of sexy voice. And, you know, it's just a voice you can listen to nonstop, whatever he does. And he's so talented with it. He's a talented musician, a talented songwriter as well, and a very, very talented musician and singer. And he's a good just everything. Friend. And a and great a, friend. And a, a good Aussie bloke with a... He's Italian. Yeah. It's a ge very gentle soul he is, but yes, yeah, very gentle soul. He's like a brother. He's like a real fantastic He's brother to us. He's always been a brother. Fabulous to meet you both. Thank you for your comments.